Hi, today I will talk about my empties and how I replace them. It has been about two months since I filmed my collection video. There I went through all my skincare and makeup products and some of them I used up so I will tell you which one they are. Since then I also added some new stuff to my collection so I will show you them as well. The first item is a body care product. Uh, this is this Clarins Tonic Treatment Oil. As you can see, I repurchased it already. I'm using this for a very long time. I really love how it feels like I apply it after the shower all over the body. Actually, they said I should apply it in the shower and rinse it off with cool water, but that's not a very pleasant thing to do, so I just dry my body first and uh, while it's still a little bit moist, I just apply this. Um, it's written here 100% plant extracts, farming and toning. I really have a feeling this keeps my skin elastic and soft. In the very beginning, I didn't like the smell, but um, in the meanwhile, I <laughs> like it. So this is something I always like to have. Uh, next items are these small day and night cream from Estee Lauder. Revitalizing Supreme Plus. Um, as I said in my collection video, I don't normally buy them because they are too expensive. But I really like them. So when I get it for free, <laughs> I, I like to use them. But I kept the jars because they are so cute and I thought I can use it for traveling. Uh, then I went back to my uh, Clarins Day and Night Cream, the uh, Extra Farming series. I also use it for a long time and I really like them. Um, it feels wonderful and smells nice as well and I really believe this prevents fine lines on the face. And next item I used up is uh, this Deluxe Sample from Bobbi Brown. This is Instant Long Wear Makeup Remover. I received several of them so I just replaced with the same thing again. Normally I use Clarins Instant Eye Makeup Remover to removing my eye makeup. That one is quite similar also. Two faces like this, you have to shake it before you use. But as I have them for free, I will just um, use them up. The performance is quite similar. But after you started to use it one time, which means after you shake it one time, those bubbles don't go away. This irritates me a little bit, but Performance is okay, similar to the Clarence one. The next stuff is another deluxe sample from Bobbi Brown, Soothing Cleansing Oil. I also had several of them, so I just replaced with the same thing again. Uh, normally, I cleanse my face only with foaming cleanser. But when you buy things from Bobbi Brown online shop, you can select one Tilux sample and I saw this there and thought I would try it out and actually I really liked it I applied this as an additional step before the foam cleanser to my face it's very lightweight oil it smells wonderful and you can wash it off easily with water I'm not sure if I will purchase it and I don't have it anymore someday but um, as long as I can 
have it as a free sample. I really like this. The next item which I used up is my concealer, which I repurchased. This is Clarins Instant Light Brush on Perfector, which is actually a highlighter. Because I don't really have dark circle due to discoloration, I just want to hide some shadows which is forming under my eyes or near my nose. So for that, it's an um, idea. I just have a wish that it would have been it would be less pink. Because compared to my foundation, this has a little bit pink undertone. They actually have uh, another one which is even more pink. This is called pink beige. And this one is uh, light beige. But still... <laughs> Um, it's a little bit pinkish, but actually when I apply it on my face, I don't really notice this has a pink color, so I'm happy with this. And the next item I used up is my Clarins Lip Gloss, Gloss Prodigy in color candy. This is actually one of the stuff which I sorted out in my collection video. There I sorted out 13 items and 5 of them I decided to use up. And 4 of them you probably have seen in my um, list of cosmetics video. Uh, because this was already gone at that time. <laughs> actually it was um, almost finished. I was using it very sparingly because I knew I can't buy this anymore. But after I sorted out in that video, I was thinking, okay, if I have to discard it now, I would just use it up quickly. So it was then gone soon afterwards. I just kept this tube um, as a color reference because I really want to find some similar color like this. Uh, now I will go through some of those few new stuff which I added to my collection. I wouldn't mention those things which I mentioned in the other video, like uh, my Bobby Brown haul video that I showed you, uh, this new Bobby Brown stuff which I bought. And I also uh, made a video about my new perfume, Rose de Chloe. So those I wouldn't mention now. The first item is an eye cream. This is also a sample from Bobbi Brown, Extra Eye Repair Cream. Although I already have an eye cream from Estee Lauder, I thought I will just uh, use it in the morning and I'm using Estee Lauder one in the evening. Uh, this is a little bit firm consistency. It's a little bit tricky to spread on my eyes, but I didn't get any additional wrinkle after I started to use this. So I'm sure it's a good one as well. But I wouldn't buy it after I empty this. And the next item is another Bobbi Brown Deluxe Sample. This one is called Vitamin Enriched Face Base. I received several of them, so uh, this is already the second one. Uh, this is also <laughs> almost empty. I think I'll show you the new one. Uh, in the beginning, I used it instead of my day cream. But then I noticed um, my skin has some tight feeling. I think it's not rich enough for me. Then I remembered Bobby Brown said one time in one interview that uh, you don't really need a primer. You can just use one of those face base and then apply foundation. Then I thought, okay, maybe I will um, use it as a primer. So after I use my normal day cream, I just apply this 
before foundation. Look like this. It smells really nice. Citrus smell. So I really love to use this. But um, I don't think I will buy it when I used up this. And the last item which I have here is my new liquid eyeliner from Estee Lauder. This is called Double Wear Zero Smudge Liquid Eyeliner. This is the um, same series as my mascara, this non-smudging mascara from Estee Lauder. Um, I was very impressed by this mascara, that it's not smudging on my eyes because this is really the first time I saw one mascara which is absolutely um, staying on my eyes without any smudge. So I um, had a look if they also have an eyeliner in the same line and they did. So I bought it and, and it really doesn't smudge. I'm really happy about this. But unfortunately, they discontinued this. I don't understand why. Uh, I, I find it very shame. So after I use this up, I don't know what I should buy. I have to search around again if there is any eyeliner which is not smudging on my eyes. So that was it for today. I hope it was interesting for you. Thanks a lot for watching. I will see you in the next video. Bye!